Alright, he's pretty tough, but he's not impossible to kill. I want to loot his giblets. Get out of here, ball sack. Come on, guys. Let me loot my first scorpion kill ever in peace, please. Guys are all a bunch of bastards. Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. Like I'm an old guy gaming, and uh, in this episode, we are probably going to go hit the traders and maybe do a little bit of looting. Um, I need, uh, whatchamacallits, beakers. I need beakers, yeah. I need beakers like crazy, um, and we need more research data and stuff to start getting these workstations upgraded now that we're in the new version of the game. Uh, so that's the plan for today. What time is it, by the way? Oh, crap, it's almost nighttime. Damn it. Damn it, Jim. All right. Um, well, let's just see what we can get done. And the nice thing about UDL, I think, I haven't actually tried this for a while, but I think that traders stay open like till midnight, don't they? Unless that's changed. It's just been a long time since I've been to a trader that late at night. Um, so what we want to do is we want to grab our dineros. I think I should have some money also. I think I'll have some money in the bike. Um, but let's take a look in here. Yeah, we got... Oh, man, we got a lot of money, actually. Uh, that's really good. We also need to find... I don't, that's not supposed to be in there. Uh, we need to find another nail gun or... Either that or I need to spend the research data to... To m make the schematic for it. So we, we're sitting in 942 research data right at the moment. So that's not terrible, but um, we just have so many things you know, that we need to research. So, uh, let's grab the shepherd's pie and, s well, we have a couple of, of these in here and we're in pretty good shape there, but I am going to take a mineral water. And we got to get cruising here because time is a wasting. All right, so let's head on out. I uh, believe the motorcycle's down below, but we will ride the mining cart down so we don't... Whoops. Whoops. Well, uh, no, wrong button. Uh, oops. <laughs> the mining cart just went through the... What the hell? Okay, here, hold on. Go back down to five. Okay. And uh, now, go to one. Yeah, this, uh, I don't like riding this elevator if I'm not in a vehicle because I've glitched through the floor enough times to where I don't trust it. But, um, for some reason the mining cart glitched too. Uh, all right, go to one. We won't take the mining cart to the traders because it's too slow, um, but I'm just riding it back down to get to the motorcycle. I do like the elevator setup though. Oh, wrong way. Uh, I do like the elevator setup though. It's pretty cool. All right. <laughs> the cart's just like vibrating like crazy. Okay, let's just park it down here. Now, eventually, these vehicles we're going to actually park up above in our garage, but we're not quite there yet. Um, why is this so doggone heavy? What do I have in here? Uh, I don't know. It's probably the weight in my inventory. Okay, so let's go hit as many traders as we possibly can before it gets too late. Greetings, friend. All right, what you guys got? We are looking for beakers and research data. Let's look in here. Antibiotics, scrap knife, scrap pistol, steel katana. Um, tempted to buy that stuff for research data, but let's hold off on that. So no beakers, huh? Uh, you know what? We need military fiber too. How much does this stuff cost? 2430. I know we need that for some of the upgrades that we have to do. So, uh, we don't need any of that stuff. And, yeah, 
Yeah, okay. I think, um, just trying to decide if I want to buy these. Uh, no, I, I, I don't think we have so much money that we can just spend it like crazy. Oh, look at that. You can buy poison now. In fact, you know what? We probably better buy some of that. So I might not be able to make it anytime soon. Um, yeah, let's just buy those. And we'll buy rock busters, we'll buy lamb rations, we'll buy eye candy, hackers, skull crushers, health bars. Eh, yeah, we probably better get some jailbreakers. We'll get some of those and some of those. All right. Oh, we didn't look at this guy. Take a look at your inventory. Uh, we need a beaker, man. Oh, look at that. Titanium sledge. Hmm. We could purchase that and then we could upgrade but I think I can make that, though, too. How much is it? 20? Nah, I don't think we will. It's a thought, though. And then what do we have here? A dr drone armor? Nah, not really interested in that so much. Needle and thread, we already know that one. No beaker, though. Hmm. Okay. Uh, look. Oh, look at that. That's one of the dirt bikes. Ooh, $32,000. We'll have to look into making that at some point. Okay. Yeah. As you wish. All right. Let's, um, where are we at here? Take a look at the map. Uh, there's another trader here. So let's go hit that one next. Good day. Good day. All right, Raiden, what you got, Ming? Oh, if you sounds wish. like we got a snake coming after us. Not anymore. Okay, um, let's see here. A beaker? You got a beaker. You don't have a beaker. We're not going to buy food off of you. Um, oh, wait, that's my inventory. <laughs> I'm gonna, I was going to say, we should sell this stuff, too. I was going to say, that looks familiar. That's because it's my inventory. Ooh, LCR-12. Machine gun. That's a new weapon. Uh, so is the cricket submachine gun. We'll probably find those things in loot. Though. I don't want to pay. I don't want to buy them. Um, at least not right now. Okay, let's look at secret stash. Learning elixir. Again, he's got some schematics we could spend money on if we wanted to, but I don't kind of really want to, you know. Uh, okay. All if right. you wish. Let's go take a look at Hugh. Oops. We will buy this and that and those and those and those. Those, those, these, those, and those. Okay. I'm kind of busy. You're not too busy for me, man. I'm your most important cuss. Ooh, there's some batteries. How much do they cost? Oh, only 54? Are they... Are they already charged? I would assume so. Okay, let's buy those. Those are cheap. We're going to need them for stuff. A boat hook. Oh, yeah, that's kind of like that hell, Hellbeard thing. One of the new weapons. Okay, I'm not really seeing anything else here. I hope that's just a, a thunder... Ooh, long double barrel. I think that's new too, isn't it? What's this? Enforcer belt. Backpack space. Well, it's a leg armor mod made out of leather. Increases cargo capacity of the wearer. How much is it? I'm buying it. Alright, I don't see anything else here that's super critical to us at the moment. Again, more... What's that? Dune Runner Suspension. Ooh, that's expensive. You know what? I don't think I have that. That's right. Do Can I math. make that? Oh, yeah, that... We can make that, and it's not actually not even that expensive. I ain't spending that much money on that thing. Okay, I guess that's all we can do here. Oh, man, am I confusing this mod with another one? 
You know what? I don't want to drive all the way to the next trader and find out I can't get in. So I'm just going to wait here until nighttime and, and see if we actually get locked out. Could have sworn we could get into the traders until midnight on this mod. But again, I might be confusing this with something else. So let's just wait and see what happens. Enforcer belt. Look at that. More backpack space. That just adds more weight capacity, right? Because we we're at 296, and now we're at 307. Okay. Very nice. I like it. Trader Joel's is now closed. It would appear that we cannot get in here after midnight. Is it going to teleport me? Yep. Well, shoot. Tell me in the comments, guys. Did that change, or am I just confusing this with... Some other mod I used to play where they stayed open till minute. Maybe I'm thinking of uh, Juarez UK. All right, well that changes our plans. Crap. Um, I think what we'll do then is does this vending machine work? Look at that lag. It does, but we got company of the feral variety so we probably better take off here damn it Jim all right well I think what I'm gonna do then is I'll meet you guys back at the base and we'll figure out what to do next I kind of don't feel like waiting out the night before we do anything more so maybe we'll go back to the base and do work on whatever we can work on um, but I have to figure out where the hell I'm at. No, okay. Yeah, we're not too far away then. All right, well, I'll just meet you guys back at the base. Okay, guys, we made it back in one piece here. Let's put uh, some stuff away here before we do the next thing, whatever that happens to be. Uh, you know, we're really not that hungry at the moment, so I think we won't eat the shepherd's pie. Maybe we'll eat this, though. That gives us some pretty good food. Got a couple of cans here we can put away. Some lamb cuts. And um, let's put... What in the heck? That was a major lag spike there. Okay. What of you guys said if I increase the intensity on the lights, it'll take away the gloom in here. But I don't think it will because they're not pointing in the right direction. But let's just try it. Yeah, see, I upped the intensity on that. It doesn't do anything at all to light up the ceiling. It just makes things more saturated down here. Um, but, you know, it was worth a try, so... I don't even know where that one was, so we'll just put it back down where it is. Or where that is for now. Okay, so let's see here. We've got some candy stuff. I'm Where in the hell am I even keeping that? We should probably have a place for our candies um i kind of consider them almost like medical items just because they give you buffs but they are and they aren't because they're not really doing anything for your health except for the health bar of course so maybe we'll keep them in here at least for now oh we have another can of sham that needs to go in here too okay what we'll just put the uh these Parts in here for now. Uh, we got a couple of raw resources. I guess I'm keeping the leather in here too. These will pr we probably just keep on our person. Okay. And then we have a bunch of money that we'll put back in the safe for the time being. So I guess the next decision now is... Oh, that's changed. Look at that. Oh, that's really cool. It's got like an old 90s PC on there. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Um, Yeah, this is cool, man. So many cool things to discover. Okay, let's put the money in here. Let's grab all the research data that we currently have. And we just need to decide what the highest priority is for upgrading. So, let's go back into here. Um, oh, yeah. I was going to 
convert these to gas. Oh, that's right. We can't do that because we have to upgrade. Maybe we better upgrade this station first then. Except for it needs a beaker is the problem, and I don't have a freaking beaker. <laughs> Damn it, Jim. Look at that upgrade, though. That looks really neat. Okay, well, that's out of the question at the moment. Um, the workbench tier two, the the hold up on that's always been the nail gun for us because we have all this. I have an extra impact driver, so we have all the rest of this stuff. Um, wow, a thousand or a hundred steel plating. That's kind of steep too. I mean, we can do it, but didn't I make? Oh yeah, we do. We have a hundred steel plating right there. Look at that. Okay, it's gonna say. I did a whole bunch of mining, so we should, whoops, I should have that stuff. Is there anything in here? We could upgrade these guys. I know they're going to be a lot larger. Um, I just don't know if that's what I want to spend my research data on quite yet. Does this have an upgrade path? It does not. Okay. So this would have made the most sense for us to upgrade because of the gasoline, but the problem is I don't have the beaker, right? So at least I'm pretty sure we checked for that already, right? Yeah. If I had a beaker, I would keep it in here. Um, or, or in here, but yeah, neither one of those. I guess this is where I was keeping the candy, so let's... We'll move all the candy slash drug items that are not medical into here and I might even put the medical items in the medicine cabinet in the bathroom just because it seems like an appropriate thing to do you know all right let's put all this stuff in here well okay if we can't do the chemistry bench what else would be really important for us to upgrade ASAP uh, what about the artisans table nope that doesn't have an upgrade path what do these require? Oh, that requires military fiber and 20 books. So we could do this. I don't know what the tier three furnace does for us. My guess is that it just is faster. Um, I don't know if it unlocks additional loot skis for us or not. Does this have an upgrade? Nope. Does this have an upgrade? Nope. Okay, so those don't need to be upgraded. Uh, research table's already level three. Yeah, so I'm, I guess we could, if I wanted to spend points on, what's this? May, oh, maintenance station tier three. The, oh, this has an upgrade. Maintenance station tier four. That would be useful. Um, definitely would be useful. So that's something we could keep in mind. The, there's the recycling thing, though. I had... I picked that up because one of you guys told me in the comments to pick it up before I did the upgrade. And I also know that that was in the patch notes a few versions back, too. I didn't notice anything in the patch notes that said that that had been corrected, so I didn't take any chances and I just picked it up. And I should have put it in here. This is where I would have put it. I would think, anyways. Uh, yeah, disassembly station. All right, let's let's see what the... Um, uh, this gets bigger, too. So I'm just going to put it out in the open for the moment. Wait, I thought this had an upgrade path. Does it not? Hmm, what about the recycle station? Is that a whole different ball of wax, then? Uh, okay, that'll only take 200 research data. This is relatively inexpensive. Because we can't just scrap stuff in our inventory anymore. Um, you know, like, for example, brass trophies. We have to use a recycling station, which is fine with me. I think that's very realistic. All right, well, let's, let's do this. Let's pin this. By golly, we're going to upgrade something. <laughs> Uh, it's gonna happen, man. All right, so let's get ten things of paper. Um, ten things of paper. Where the heck do I have the paper? Uh, I should have a whole mess of paper in here. Okay. I usually keep paper in the ammo for shotgun shells, but it's a multi. 
uh, multi-use item, of course, so it can go in a lot of different places. Okay, that takes care of the paper. We need 50 plastic. Whoops. Uh, we need 5 oil, 50 rubber, and some scrap. What the heck are those doing in there? Okay, 50 rubber. I think I keep rubber in here. Yeah. And 100 scrap, which is going to be in the metal bin. Oh, for Pete's frickin' sake. All right. Craft it in the... Yeah, that's just to make the schematic. Then we have to actually make the bench. Okay. Okay, that's going to take a minute. Now, could we also... Science. Where would we make the... What's that? Gyrocopter accessories. Where would we make the nail gun? The schematic. I mean, we make it in here, but what? Mainly in tools. Right here. Okay, so... If we make this, then we have an extra nail gun that we can use to upgrade our tool bench to a tier 3. So, I think... We'll look at this next, but I want to wait till this is done to see what we need to make the actual bench first. So let's, well, let's not even pin that quite yet. So what we're going to do is put this stuff back in here for now. And that schematic should be done. There we go. Okay, now, where do we make the actual recycle? In... No, it's uh, here. In the workbench. Okay, so it's going to need all of this stuff. So let's pin all that. Repair kits. That doesn't seem very expensive. There's just a lot of crap. So, um, all right. Well, let's start gathering all the crap then. We need five logs. One, two, three, four, five. We need 20 boards. We need 40 plastic. We need 20 iron plating. We need 20 gears. We might have to make those. Yep, we only have four gears. Okay, I think we make gears in here, right? Uh, ooh, we need whole steel ingots for that. Well, that's a problem. Damn it, Jim. Uh, shoot. All right, what we might end up having to do then is... I don't have any iron ingots left either, do I? All right, we might have to make some iron ingots from the scrap iron to then make steel ingots to make the gears. I think we... Does this, doesn't this make like five at a time? Uh, craft. Really? It only makes one? Son of a bitch. <laughs> it's expensive, man. All right. So we need 15 uh, steel ingots, which means we need 30 iron ingots. All right. So let's go here. Put some wood over there. And we're going to make it out of here. And we're going to make 30 of these, which we can then turn into 15 steel ingots which we'll need to make 15 gears. All right. So while we're waiting for that, uh, we need five pipes. 
Uh, are you kidding me? Do I not have any pipes either? You know what? I might not because I might have turned them all into pipe bombs. Oh, never mind. We have five pipes. Okay, we're good. We got that part covered. Uh, see, 30 paper and two adhesive. Thirty paper, adhesive. I think I have adhesive in the Kim box. Yeah. Okay, we got that covered. We need twenty mechanicals. We need two circuit boards. Five wire. Man, that is a lot of crap. <laughs> so many things in this. And it looks like we already have two repair kits, so yeah, we're just waiting now on the gears. Okay, now we'll turn these into 15 steel ingots. Wait a second. No, 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 no. What did I just do? Oh, crap. I guess I have more iron ingots than I thought I did. How did I miss that? Oh, they're not in here. Where are they at? Those aren't even supposed to be in there at all. They're in my inventory. How did I... I don't know. I can't explain it, you guys. I can't explain it. All right. Well, um, that's good, though. That is good. So, um, we just need 15 of these. And then those we can turn into the gears. Okay. I must have pulled it out when I pulled something else out and just didn't notice that I had that many. You guys are probably screaming at the screen. Oh, gee, you got a crap done. Yeah, see, we can, we no longer have the option to scrap this because that's why we need this recycle bin. But again, I'm down with that. It makes sense. It makes perfect sense. I like it. I think it's a good idea. We're going to do it, man. We're going to do it. Um, let's put these gas cans back in here since I can't do anything with them until we get this station up here. Yeah, Beaker's going to be like super mega high priority for us, ladies and gentlemen. Mega high priority. Okay, now let's turn these into gears. Those damn gears are expensive, man. We need to get, get out and do some more salvaging. Maintenance station... Yeah, that's, I mean, every we're going to upgrade everything. It's just really a matter of, again, you know, what's the priority? I don't suppose we could research a beaker, could we? Without needing a beaker to research the beaker? Have I even looked at that? Ooh. Oh, look at that, you guys. Do I have five raw diamonds? I don't know. If I did, they'd probably be in here. No. Okay, then the next likely place would be in here. I have two raw diamonds. Son of a beech nut. Okay. Well, that option's uh, not on the table then. Okay, we're just about done with these guys. Um... Hmm. Okay. Well, you know, it's good to know, though, that we can eventually make those. I thought one of you guys said if I scrap the lantern, we can get a battery. Let's just try that with this one. Um, scrap. Okay, so how come I can scrap this? Is that all it's going to do is just give us glass? Yeah, that's all it's going to do. Okay, so maybe if you scrap it, uh, or maybe it's the disassembly station. Um, how come it's no longer, it doesn't give me any recipes anymore? The hell? Hmm. Oh, you know what? Is this, is this deprecated? I mean, does it no longer is it no longer a thing? Maybe that's what's going on here. Oh, so this has been removed. This isn't even in the game anymore. I I have it because 
because I had it, you know, previously, but it doesn't have any recipes in it anymore. Okay, so let's just pick this up because this block could potentially cause us problems. I'm just going to hang on to it for now. But that that's probably what's going on with that because it's not giving me an option to, um, you know, do anything with it. That's got 15 slots. That has 20 slots. Okay, so what we'll probably do then is we'll put medicinal stuff in here. So bandages, first aid kits, pills, uh, vitamins, that kind of thing we'll probably put in here. And this we'll probably put in drug items like... Um, uh, moonshine, Grandpa's Moonshine... Uh, fort bites that sort of thing and then food type candy we can keep in here all right so let's grab that and that recog i'd say that's more of a drug these are more candies i mean again they're all kind of crossover categories but there we'll stick that stuff in there Okay, let's go get our gears. Okay, now to make the recycle thingamadoodle, we have to do that in the workbench. Carpenter's table, festivity deco. You know, we're going to have to make this because Christmas is coming up. We'll do some Christmas deco. You make first aid bandages in here? In the workbench? Hmm. Okay. Um, what are we looking for? We're looking for the recycle. Okay. Okay, that's going to take a minute to make. We still have 742 research data. Um, so... What would be the next thing? I guess the next thing could be the nail gun schematic so that we can then get this upgraded. So we don't have a mechanics table upgrade. So we don't have to worry about that, but we do have this. Um, all right, so let's pin that. And uh, let's go back to here. nail um actually yeah i want to pin this not the other thing okay so we're gonna need all that stuff yeah I, I think it's time to do this i've been holding out for such a long time to find a nail gun and it just hasn't happened not that i've been doing a lot of looting and we've we spent so, so much time working on the deshong in the last several episodes um okay so let's see we need 10 uh, we're gonna find a books in the other room we need 20 things of of steel. And it's morning. Okay, we're gonna need 20 of these. You know, we're gonna go back out and hit some more traders and watch. We're gonna find a freaking nail gun that he's gonna have for sale. I'm gonna be so pissed. We need to make five more gears. And 30 plastique. And then the 10 books are in the safe in the other room. Uh, okay, so five. So we need to make five more steel ingots. To make the gears. And we'll make ourselves a nail gun schematic. We'll learn the nail gun schematic. And then we'll have to figure out what it's going to cost to actually make it. Hopefully it's not going to be too out of reach for us. And we want five of those. Okay. In the meantime, let's grab our new recycling station. Oh, that is cool, man. Look at that. Okay. Um, 
This needs to go in a corner. So... I'm gonna just put it here for now. This isn't necessarily gonna be its permanent home, though. Look at this, this is cool. Input, output. Oh, it's gotta be powered, okay, we can do that. We can do that. Let's get ourselves some more electrical wire. We already have a wiring tool. And I'm going to want to put a relay down for this in a place that makes sense. Well, oh, look at that. It's going to go to this. That takes 120 watts. Are you kidding me? Holy Moses, that's a lot of power. Let's see what we got on the Jenny right at the moment. Yeah, we I mean, we've got enough to support it, but my goodness. That's expensive, man. Okay, well, you know what? For now, this isn't going to be the final wiring configuration but for now let's just hook it up to here hello hook up there we go wow 120 watts good lord that's expensive okay this is really cool looking though man so now what we do is we take these and we put them in here Does it have an animation? Oh, it even does. <laughs> Look at that. That's cool. I love it. I love it. Okay, cool. I'm just I, I'm just amazed at how much power it takes, though. Goodness. Okay, let's grab these gears. And we'll go into Hither. We need 20 books. Ooh, we don't have that many books, do we? And now we should be able to make the nail gun schematic. You know what? I'm going to be so freaking irritated if we find a nail gun. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to put all of these items in here. We're going to go out and about. Uh, no, we didn't need those. We're going to go out and about and hit a couple more traders. And if I don't find the nail gun at the traders, then we will come back and we will spend all of this stuff to make one. That's the plan, Stan. We are a man with the plan. And our name is not Stan. In case you guys didn't know that. Okay, let's um, put a couple things away. Put the tool in here. I got more things I could sell, but I'm not going to... That's not the thing. That's not the thing we're doing right now. Let's put all those back in there. Those can go in there. We're going to keep the antidotes with us in case we run into a uh, scorpion. Has he changed the... He's changed the model on that too, huh? Those look really nice. Very cool. Okay, so we are doing good on food and water. So yeah, let's set out again. Uh, I'm going to grab my money. Uh, let's set out again and go hit a few more traders before we wrap up this episode. If we're lucky, we'll find ourselves a beaker. And if we're not lucky, we won't find ourselves a beaker. Or, or a nail gun. Okay. So, uh, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to mark... Uh, that was the last trader. So, I'm going to mark this trader way down here in the southeast. And I will meet you guys over there. We'll check that one. Then we'll run up to this one, check that one. And then we'll run over to this one. Wait, yeah? Yeah, that one, that one, and that one. Okay, so I'll see you at each one of those traders respectively. Oh, we found a scorpion. Oh, shit, there's another one there, too. Uh, all right, how mean are these things? I, there was a, like a red one back over here that I just drove by, but then we got this green one. I think he's a poison scorp, right? 
Oh, he's irradiated. Oh, shit. There's one there, too. I think that's the one I saw before. What? Uh, he's a blood scorpion. Okay, does that mean he causes a bleed effect on us? Hey, get away from my motorcycle, dude. All right, he's pretty tough, but he's not impossible to kill. I want to loot his giblets. Get out of here, ball sack. Come on, guys. Let me loot my first scorpion kill ever in peace, please. You guys are all a bunch of bastards. Where's the scorp at? He's right here. Look at all that, man. I know we need some of this stuff for, like, making antidotes and making the chitin armor and stuff like that. All right, let's see how tough the the red, or the blood guy is. He's pretty fast. Hmm, okay. Has he got the same kind of stuff on him? No, we just got chitin fat and meat off of that guy. Okay, let's try this other one. I know we're ma majorly getting sidetracked, but hey, this is our first, uh, our first time with the scorps. Is that another irradiated or is that a poison? Seemed like the yeah he's an irradiated. Seems like the irradiated was harder to kill than the blood scorpion maybe, but I I couldn't say for a certainty. Does he know we're here? I don't know. Oh, you know what? I got points to spend, you guys. We got some points to spend. Do it. You know what? I It seems to me like, I know this is going to sound duh, but it seems to me like headshots actually matter because when I aimed right for his head, he his health went down quick, but I was, when I was hitting him kind of more in the carapace, it was like armor. So that does make sense. Oh, did we get more giblets from that? We've only gotten one venom sack. Oh, wow, that's needed for a lot of things, but it's definitely needed for the poison antidote. Chitin Knuckles, Chitin Club, Chitin Plating, Chitin Saber. Interesting. Okay. Mandibles. What are those for? Yeah, those are needed for some of those Chitin weapons. And then the Chitin itself, of course, is going to be needed for uh, the armor and all that. All right, cool. Well, um, those guys, are <coughs> excuse me, they're definitely tough. There's no doubt about it, but they're not, they're, you know, it's not like we can't kill them. I, I wasn't sure how, how tough they were going to be. Remember, we're playing on insane difficulty, too, so, you know, that's got to factor in, too, to how tough they actually are. But we can still take them out. I'm not going to, like, go up to one and pet it, but you know what I'm saying. Woohoo! All right, so we know we can find a blood scorpion and an irradiated scorpion in the wasteland. Uh, are there other flavors of scorpion that we can find in the wasteland too? You know, I'm tempted to run into that bookstore really quick, but I want to I want to hit all the traders before I let you guys go, and I can't let myself get sidetracked, or we're gonna it's gonna go way too long. So, um, yeah. All right, let's just get over to that trader. We will kill any more scorpions we come across, though, because I want to get more of the poison gland sack thingies. What do you want from me? Okay. You don't look so good. I don't look so good. What are you talking about? I'm fine. Ooh, we need these. I think we can get these from stumps, but ooh, that's kind of expensive. Yeah, let's see if we can farm those from stumps. I'm not going to pay that much money for queen bees, but we can make beehives and we can make chicken. Ooh, 
How much are those? Well, those aren't that expensive. Okay, well, it's nice to know we can buy them from the traders if we need to. Um, you know what, though? Yeah, that's, that's a lot of money. I mean, we could afford it, but still, that is a hell of a lot of money. Let's buy these because those are cheap and we are going to need them. We've got a crucible in there. That's kind of nice. Uh, all right, let's look in... Unfortunately, there's no beaker in that stuff. So you can actually buy the scorpion parts from them, too. That's interesting. Okay. Um, what is that? Tech Junkie Volume 6. Or no. Uh, wait. Yeah? Volume 6? Yeah. This technique is a 24 for regular 50 power attacks instantly. Oh, that's, that's for stun batons. We don't do stun batons. How much is this? I actually wouldn't mind having another auger. <clears throat> All right. Well, she doesn't really have what we're looking for either Good. but let's try this guy uh, no beaker in here or what about in here spear hunter no nah, we don't care about spear hunter nothing man look at this though the trident that's cool that's a new weapon what's this misshaped junk blade interesting Okay, well... Really? Yeah, really. You guys don't have what I'm looking for. Oh, no, we gotta go up this way. Alright, I'll see you guys at the next trader. Ooh. There's a big scorp. <laughs> oh, hey, you know what? Before we take that scorp on... Um, let's do points. I have four points, I think. We got three of them from Horde Knight, and then I got another one from Mining. Uh, so we're working on Perception. Let's get that up to seven so we can get Deadeye up to four. And let's see, Lucky. Yeah, let's get Lucky Looter all the way up. We already have Living Off the Land. I want Penetrator. Uh, I would like to get archery up eventually, but how many points do we have left? Oh, none. That's it. Okay, we're done. <laughs> I, I mostly wanted to get Deadeye up another point because uh, we actually are going to be able to use it right now. All right. I'd like to see if we get a headshot off on this dude. There we go. Look at that, man. We took him out in two shots right in the head. Okay, we're out of stamina now. Now we got a bear to deal with. But we're also more powerful now, too, because we put more points into sniping. Well, let's make sure we get a headshot off on him. Still tough as hell, man. These guys are tougher than scorpions. Is it just me or has our attack speed slowed down on this? We didn't get a gland, darn it. Okay. I guess that's a fairly rare drop from them dudes then, huh? What have we killed? Four scorps so far and we've only gotten one gland? Why is my shotgun not reloading? I just shot a shot and I won't uh, reload. All right, that guy's, forget him. Okay, come on, Jen, I need a beaker. I really do need a beaker. Um, a crude ax, look at that thing. She's got bees too. Oh, look at that, she's got 3,000. Oh, man, how much would all that cost us? <laughs> a 
Lord. We could sure use it though, man. We could sure use that. Okay, let's keep that in mind. That is a hell of a lot of research data. Um, we need these for chicken coops, but I think we can catch them. I'd rather, I'd rather do the chicken coops and the bees by gathering the stuff rather than buying them. Um, wow, that is tempting. That is really tempting. Okay, so here, let's look at secret stash. Hobo stew, truck maintenance. Oh, that's right. We need... We're going to need these. Look how expensive they are, too. That's pretty expensive. All right. Well, what are these? Oh, those are 556s. Five, five, They're like in aluminum casings. Um, Do I want to spend... Twelve thousand, almost thirteen thousand coin. But man, that could be enough research data. Oh no 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 no! no. That's a hundred and twenty-nine thousand, not twelve thousand. <laughs> Crap. Uh, right. All right. How much would a thousand cost us? It would cost us a good chunk of our our money. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, we could get a lot done with a thousand, though, too. We really could. Um, it's just that if we come across a beaker, I don't know how much beakers are going to cost. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'm going to just remember. Sorry, but I've never heard of a stim pack. That uh, Trader Gen has those, but let's not actually do anything. Oh, there's a scorp right there. Uh, did we get a ball sack's attention? Yep. Okay, let's see if we can take out this um, scorpion here. Turn that head around. Oh, that's a Leviathan scorpion. Oh, he can spit. Is he is he bigger than the other ones? Leviathan would seem to indicate that. Wow, he was harder to kill, man. Look at that, we got Venom Sack. All right. Nice. Very nice. Okay. I guess I must have killed that stuff a long time ago. All right, where's the next trader? Um, we've already checked that trader, so we've got Trader Hugh in our in our original town. He's right here. I don't even know why I don't have him marked. I guess because I know where he is, right? Uh, but let's mark him. Oh, frickin' caps lock key. All right, so I guess we will go towards him next, and then we also have a snow trader and a desert trader that we can visit. Because, you know, until we can get a beaker, I can't make gasoline. So I think that's our numero uno priority is getting a beaker. And if we can't buy one, then we might have to research Oh, there's forest right there. Huh. Okay, I'll see you over at the other trader. All right, we haven't been back to this town in a while. This is where we started out at. It seems like such a long time ago. It was such a long time ago. All right, let's check it. Raiden first. Yeah, I remember... <laughs> <laughs> this Raiden got stuck in the corner early on, and he's been there ever since. He's supposed to be standing right here. That's funny. All right, let's take a look at your inventory. And long double barrel, compound bow, 
Club, Art of Mining, Corn on the Cob recipe. Nope, doesn't really Very have, well. have what we're looking for. Okay, let's try Q. Oh, I should take a one of these to help reduce that a little bit. We've got Does this look a big like antibiotics back at the base, so I'm not too worried about the infection. We'll fix it when we get home. I do need to eat something, though. Uh, let's have some of this. And some of this. How much do these sell for? Not a lot. Okay, come on, man. We need a beaker. Quit screwing around. And get me a beaker. Ooh. Magnum Enforcer. Craft Armor Piercing 44. Hmm. I mean, yeah, sort of useful. Yeah, let's buy it. What the hell? At some point, we'll probably start messing around with a 44. Uh. Don't really care about any of that stuff so much. Art of Mining, whatever that does, that, that black strap. Uh, we'll take the Pistol Peat. Pistols to create slower. And we'll take all your batteries. That's pretty much it, though. I mean, I'm, I'm not really interested in anything else he has. Okay, we have two more traders to check. On. I'll see you guys over there. We're going to go to the Snow Trader next, and then we're going to go to the Desert Trader. Um, after I buy stuff out of here. I don't think we really need any more sugar butts. Uh, we don't need pears. We don't need chicken. We have quite a bit of these now. Uh, let's get the salmon. Let's buy another smoothie. The sham and the eye candy. I think we're good on the rest of that stuff. Okay, let's start hitting stumps so we can get some queen bees. Oh, here, I should probably read these too. Nope. Okay. I think that I think the queen bees from the stumps are a fairly rare drop too. But we'll eventually get what we need. It'll be nice to produce our own honey and our own eggs. We caught a chicken! Ha-ha! Nice. Um, that's nice, too. You know what, though? I don't care about those. Let's scrap and get the, the data. All right. Uh, you're kind of right where we need to go, Mr. Bear. Seriously? Get out of here. Oh, shit. Okay. Nothing to lose your head over. Hi, Jen. Meds, drugs, booze. And lag. And you have lag, too. Okay. Um, let's see here. Azalea. Choose box. Shop cards. Ooh, she's got a raven. $270,000. Yowzers. <laughs> we are going to, we're going to do aircraft. It'll happen, guys. It'll happen. I just don't know exactly when, but it'll happen. All right. Doesn't look like she's got a beaker. Maybe, can we not even get a beaker from the trader? Maybe we can't. Ooh, yeah, we want that. Yep. Okay. We want that. Uh... Hector's Wrath. Um, is that the one that has like the... The, um, you know, the, the shock thing? I had that on my season one, or I had something on season one of Undead Legacy that would shock them. Um, all right. We have now one... that was a good deal. More opportunity. I'm a doctor. You're a doctor. Let's buy this. 
I think we have plenty of oh shits. I don't think we need chicken soup. Yeah, I think that's good enough. Uh, chicken soup doesn't have a recipe, but the soup stock How's does. How's it going? It's going, Hagen. How you doing, man? All right. Can you set us up with a beaker? Not in this menu. What about in this menu? Wouldn't be a bad idea to learn that, actually. Well, there's no reason to. We, we can make the good stuff, so... No point. Uh, I don't think we need to buy any more batteries at this point, either. Gumbo stew. Doo -doo -doo -doo. What's that? Ooh, Vindicator shotgun. Nice. We'll eventually find, like I said, these new weapons in loot, though. I'm not going to buy them. Well, okay. As we have, you wish. We have one more opportunity to find a beaker from a trader. If that doesn't work, we're going to go... Uh, Where am I going? We're going to go the probably the blueprint route to make one because... That is definitely holding us up. Okay, I'll see you at this final trader. Come here, chicken. Come here, chicken. Got him. <laughs> Whoa. There's another chicken. How many chickens do we need? Here, let's see. Recipes. We need... Oh, we got enough! Nice! Okay, we'll make a chicken coop when we get back to the base. fan friggin -tastic. Nope, no bees yet. Oh, look at that. Okay, that's a new it's a new kind of scorpion. It's purple. That's just a normal wolf. No, that's a dire shit. I don't want him sneaking up on us. He won't be sneaking up on us. Will he fight the lumberjack? Oh, he does fight the lumberjack. Okay, let's see who's gonna win. Is he like a frost scorpion? He must be. Yeah, frostbite scorpion. Okay, knock the lumberjack down. We've got a bunch of other lumberjacks around here. Ah, oh, he killed them. Nice. Okay. Chet. Come here. That was a glancing blow. Alright, what do we get off this guy? Anything special? No, it looks like it's the same same stuff. Alright. Well that was cool though. Just see a new kind a new kind of scorp though. Alright, let's get back to business here. We still got one more trader to check. Is there a desert scorpion? Yeah, there'd probably be like a fire scorpion in the desert, huh? Let's see if we can find a fire scorpion. Oh, right there, right there, right there. Okay, let's get him. Try to be real quiet. Uh-oh. Nice. Ah, we got a venom sack. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, cool. I'm out of ammo? No way! Hmm. I must have... I must have put ammo away. Um, my... Oh, there's two scorpions. He's a blood scorpion.
All right. He wasn't that hard to kill. More venom sacks. Okay, well, we're not going to have any trouble making poison antidote. There's even another scorp over there. Yeah, I must have accidentally put my sniper ammo away. Are those both blood scorpions? I think so. That scorpion's gonna wreck that zombo. Wow, the shotgun goes a number on these guys. Either that or I just got some lucky pellets in the head. There's another venom sack. Maybe that's all it was. I don't know. All right, Jen. Don't let us down. We need a beaker, and you're a doctor. The name's Jenny, but you can call me Dr. Jen. Dr. Jen, I need a beaker. Damn it. Damn it, Jen. What's that? Oh, that's right. There's go-karts. It's only $27,000. But there's a, there's a Humvee. Um, okay, what about here? 4X scope, another th motorcycle, but again, I'm not paying, I'm not going to pay that much money for that. Okay, nope, she doesn't have oh, what we are need. are you leaving so soon? Yeah, I am, because, oh, you know, you don't have what I while. want. We will buy this, and we will buy that, and we will buy that. Don't need the rest of that. Well, actually, is that... Yeah, we want to buy that because we'll eventually be able to make Learning Elixir or one of those thingies with that. Yes? Yes. Okay. A cricket bat. That's cool. <laughs> I love all this new stuff, man. An impact driver... A mini dump truck. Look how, oh my goodness, that's over a million? Lord almighty. Wow. Okay. Uh, hit. Nope, he doesn't got one, man. All right, well, I think then what we're going to have to do, what's this? Bar brawling, drinking beer. Oh, yeah, we want that. That way we can actually drink beer for mining with a buff and we won't get uh, we won't get the blurry vision. Uh, what's this do? Bats. Bang. Missing. Oh, you can craft steel clubs. Nah, I don't care about that. Um, Empty shopping basket. Okay, well, I guess that's, that's it. Goodbye. We hit every trader that I have uncovered on this map. And we have not found a beaker. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the base. And we're going to research a beaker and make the blueprint for it. Because until we can get a beaker, You're looking kind of rough. we're kind of gimped a little bit. Without me being able to make gas. I mean, you don't have a ton of gas. Yeah, yeah, you know what? I'm done killing scorpions for now. We've killed plenty of scorpions there. All right, you guys. Well, I'm going to let you go here. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video. And we'll catch you in the very next episode. See ya.